There's someone inside that car. They're pinned by debris. Just a little more. I've got you. Stay calm. Need to find the people who caused this. They've still got to be nearby. after some serious financing.
boy. Rockets! They got rockets! Sorry, no time for you guys now. Be good, little demons. Check back with me later. I can't believe I haven't slept since the Fisk takedown. Gotta start taking better care of myself. What are you doing here so late? Pete, what time is it? <sighs> Gotta pee. Hope May's couch is comfortable. I can't take this. You can, and you will. I'll pay you back. Soon. Just ask for help next time. Oh, you are so much like Ben. You have to learn to swallow that Parker pride and accept that you're human, like the rest of us. Martin. I'm sorry to interrupt. I just wanted to let you know I'm headed out of town. You're in charge while I'm gone. Well, you can count on me. How long will you be away? Uh, I really don't know. Is everything okay? It's some personal business I've been planning for a while. But please take care of this place. It represents the best part of me. Well, I guess I better get busy. Hope Mr. Lee's okay. Hello? Hey, did you see my story? I did. Robbie must be pretty happy right now. Yeah, it kind of went viral. And get this, Mayor Osborne just announced he's going to give Officer Davis an award this afternoon. Wow. Wait, isn't Osborne's campaign rally this after? Oh, I see what he's doing. Yeah, we all do. But still, a pretty cool moment for Officer Davis and his family. I'll be there covering it. Wanna join me? Yeah, of course. See you then. So humiliating taking money from May. I should head out into the city and try to pay it forward. 
Snacky time. Howard, long time no see. How's Pidgey doing? He's a little down today. Misses his cousins. Been a bit of a whirlwind for both of us. Owners of my building, rezoned for commercial. We had to move into Feast to get our bearings. I'm so sorry. New York landlords can really be heartless. When they kicked me out of my place, they set all my birds loose. Pidgey's the only one who found me. I've been looking everywhere for the rest of them, but with my bad leg and all... You know what? I'd get around. How about I keep an eye out for him? You do that? Oh, thank you. If you have any luck, please give me a call. Chase is on. Hey, Jeff. Congrats on the ceremony today. I'll be glad when it's over. A truck full of armed demons scares me less than public speaking. But I'm calling about something else. What's up? Just got a tip that the demons are moving on the Fisk construction site in Midtown. My wife would kill me if I did the ceremony prep to play cops and robbers, but I thought maybe my friendly neighborhood partner would want to know. Understood. I'll do a swing by, let you know what I find. And hey, here's a tip on public speaking. Just picture everyone in their underwear. Wait, not Osborne. You know what? Uh, never mind. <laughs> Another message from Doc. Peter, I don't want to jinx us, but the lead I'm following might not only get the project back on its feet, but also expand it in ways we never could have imagined. Everything happens for a reason. Even Norman pulling our plug. Really hope this works out. Doc's work is too important to go unfinished. Good use. Hey, Howard, I think I found one of Pidgey's cousins. Dusty Gray Flex, might have just left a stain on my suit? Clearance. The guy's a little devil, <laughs> but he's a charmer. Better give him a pat on the head and point him towards feet. He'll find his way. No problem. I'll do the same for any others I find.
on, buddy. Responsibility to catch that pigeon. I can't believe that. Taking you home, buddy. away. Sandra, she's got some fine birds. Oh, uh, yeah. Sure we are, Spider-Man. Thanks again. And please, keep an eye out. Pigeon alert! It's getting away. I hope nobody sees me doing this. It's all over the news. Another battle between Spider-Man and these demon mask gunmen threatening the lives of New Yorkers. I understand our next caller lives in here. You're on. Which agent are dead? Yeah, um... The thing is, it all happened... ...in a shipyard that's the most of you. There weren't any innocent people. Oh, is that your expert opinion? Well, let me tell you what I've learned from sources I developed in my award-winning journalism career. That shipyard was a front for Wilson Fisk. He's been using it to smuggle guns, grenades, military-grade ordnance. Oh, that explains a lot. Ah, the truth bomb strikes. But wait, here's a 50-megaton payload of fact. While Spider-Man tried to grab the glory for himself, chasing one truck, another vehicle got away with an arsenal of deadly, illegal weapons. This, all his faults, would never have let them be used in the city. But these demons? Either they're some kind of fanatical cult, or they just don't care. Anybody feel like they're in danger now?
knows the city better than I do. Howard's pigeons. It's getting away. Buddy. Oh, Spider-Man, you're a prince. You just found Vanessa in the law. <laughs> I love these names. Is Sandra happy to see them back? Well, uh, actually, she's not with us anymore. Can't you know. Howard, I'm so sorry. Oh, it's okay. Life for living, not moving. The first thing she told me after the diagnosis. Gotta remind myself of that every now and again. Keep looking, will you? Find out the rest of these birds that really mean a lot. Thanks, Spider-Man. Pigeon alert! It's getting away. Pigeons eat spiders. Thank <laughs> you. 
buddy. All units, we just got a reported assault in progress. Proceed to Morningside Heights. Something's going down at the Fisk construction site. You gotta remember to check it out. One of Howard's pigeons! Oh, come back, little birdie! Hey, slow down! Man, I wish I spoke pigeon. Chase is on. Now that she's gone, they're yours. Feels like a part of her lives on that way, you know? I definitely know. You're a good man, Howard. Anytime you want to stop by and see the family, <laughs> feel free. Darren says he misses you. Thanks again, Spider-Man. 